Hi guys, it's Otto here from Tonal.com and today I'm going to show you how to program an electric cassette awning uh, with an array motor. And for that I need a remote control, an RTS remote control. In this case it's a smooth origin RTS, but you can use any Sonfi RTS remote control to do exactly what I'm going to be doing. So the first step is to make sure that the motor has power of course. And then the next step is that you take your remote control and then you press the up and down button at the same time to make sure you get control over the motor. So that's it. I get the confirmation with a jog from the motor and that means um, it's in programming mode. So now what we can do is uh, check the um, direction in which the motor is rolling. So when I press down I want it to go out and that's happening. Um, if that's not the case then what you can do is press the my button and keep holding it for about three seconds. The motor will give a jog and then it will have reversed its direction. So next step is to set the lower limit, so where it's rolling out. And to do that I need to press my and down at the same time. That's it, the screen will start rolling out. And now I need to press the stop button, so the my button, as soon as it's in the right, the, the right position. So for me that's about here. I press the my button to stop it. And from here I can still adjust it, so if I wanted to go up a little bit or down, I can adjust it still. Next thing I can do is press the my and up button and then the awning will start rolling in. I can release the buttons and now the awning will stop automatically because the uh, motor will detect that it's at the end of the, of the run so that it hits the casing. And because it's a cassette awning it will stop automatically. So that's why the motor is only uh, suitable for a cassette awning. Now what I need to do is confirm the end limits which I can do by pressing the my button and holding it until the motor jogs. That's now. And the last thing I need to do is turn over the remote control and press the program button on the back and keep holding that until the motor jogs. That's now. So now the motor's programmed. Let's test that by pressing the down button and see if it rolls out and stops automatically. That's the difference when you're in programming mode, you need to keep holding the buttons. Um, when it's been programmed, it will just run to its final position. That's it. And I can press up and it will go in. And then again, it will stop at the, uh, the position where the cassette starts. And there we are, the motor stopped. So all has been working perfectly. Program mode finished. Um, so that's it really. Um, programming um, an Aurea RTS motor with a smooth Origin RTS or any RTS remote control. Now if it doesn't work out for you or if you have any questions, you can send me an email at info at For now, thanks for watching. See you in the next one.